The acrylic prism set allows students to investigate refraction, geometric optics, as well as internal reflection and critical angle. The set comes with a refraction block, an equilateral prism, a semicircular lens, two concave lenses, one convex lens, and a storage case that has foam for protection. It also includes an activity guide with six different guided activities. One of the fun things that you can do with a prism is to show students how it can refract a light ray. A single color laser beam is not as much fun as using continuous light. So our flashlight is going forward. I'm going to put this right at the very, very tip and then just back away about 20 feet or so. The nice thing about this optical component set, or any set really, is that you don't have to use a laser beam or a very bright light source. You can simply use a set of pins. What I've done is outlined the optical component and then just put two pins, doesn't matter where, they're representing an incoming light ray. So we move down so that we are looking straight on the side of the refraction block and we can see the tops of the pins but we're more interested in the image that we see in the refraction block. So all I'm going to do is pivot this around until those two images line up with each other. And then as best as you can, place two pins on this side of the refraction block that line up with that image. So now when you look back at the top, these two pins represent the incoming light ray and these two represent the light ray coming out on the other side. What I'm going to do is connect the dots on each side to the outline I made for the refraction block. Once I've connected the lines for the incoming light ray and the outgoing light ray, I also connected it where they met at the surface of the refraction block and that gave us the angle of the light ray inside the optical component. The prism set is a perfect solution for you to study magnification, prism, or geometric optics in your classroom as well as having its own perfect storage solution.